Hey, what's up, guys? It's Electron Designs, and this is the new tutorial for Cinema 4D. Today, I'll be showing you how to make um, Cinema 4D material or like texture, like this, like I did in my um, recruitment challenge. See that? Like that ground? Uh, yeah. Alright, so first, you're gonna wanna do that. You open it. Specular. Ah, can't really see it, but yeah, put it. I put it to 70, the width, the height, I put it to 30, and the fall off, I put it to 2. The color, put it um, all the way dark. Alright, and, um, again, a glow, but I don't know. Uh, I want to suggest it. Okay, so to, to get your thing like this, um, you're going to have to go to Google. Or you can, get to, you can go into your GFX pack, um, go to textures and stuff. I'll, put, I'll get random texture. Texture, alright. Oh, see which one looks good. None of these really look good. Well, okay, this one. Okay, it looks all right. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. All right. Uh. Oh yeah. Um, for you start saving and stuff, uh, texture. Make sure it doesn't have like anything around it, cause then it'll be added to the uh, material thing and Cinema 4D. So make sure it's like a picture like. Well, you get like this doesn't have the little um borders around it. When you look, last save. Alright, save. Okay, when you open it, see it doesn't have the borders. But some actually show like a name or something and it shows like a border. Do not don't don't download those because then um you'll you'll see in the uh Cinema 4D as a material. Alright, you put it right there. Alright, so you have your thing right there on your desktop. I'm gonna go back to Cinema 4D. Okay, then press on the same thing. Color, go on color. Texture, go on that. And you're gonna wanna find your texture. Let's see, what was the texture I called? Okay, DK. There we go, open. The image, this image is not in the project search path. Do you want to create a copy at the project location? Yes. And there you go, you have your um, thing, but you're gonna have to do some stuff. Okay, so it's not that you don't want it that strong, so I'm just, so put it to seventy. There you go. Yeah, glow. No, nah. Uh, I said I, I said don't add one. So yeah, <clears throat> I'm I'm kind of studying, stuttering. Ugh. All right, uh, I'm gonna wait for text so I can show you how it looks. Actually, no. Oh, shoot, not responding. Oh, it's gonna work. I I don't know why it does this. It, it would be it, it would be better if I did it on my desktop, not my desktop. I mean laptop, because it wouldn't take so long. Okay. Ooh. Well, actually, let's not do it with that. Let's do it with um, landscape. All right. Gonna bump it up a little bit. Let's see. Use the magnet. There we go. Bring it up a little, so it's like more up there. Alright, well, okay, let's see y'all. Oh. <coughs> Dang it, I'm not too used to moving the camera in this. Okay, whatever. Just move it up a little bit more. Alright, there we go. Okay, so you have your thing right there. And, okay, gosh, shit. Okay, now you can just put it on there. You run, you, when you render it out, it'll look like that. Well, it's not looking good. It's not looking as good, so you're going to want to press on the material on here. Then you're gonna want to go on project projection, and you're gonna have to go to uh, cubic, and there and there it makes it smaller and it looks more nicer. All right, so um, you know, I want to make it smaller a little bit. I'll put it to like 70. The length I'll put it to let's see 60. Yeah. Um, <coughs> my bad. Um, I right, render it out, and that's how it looks. Alright, uh, we could, we can add text to it or something, not text to it, but yeah. Let's see, let's see what we could do with our glow. No, glow. Let's see, 10, 10, 5, there we go. You can render it out. And yeah, you can see the glow. Yeah, it doesn't look as nice, so I'm just going to take that off. Okay, and I'm going to show you how to make another material. Um, just like color material. Okay, you go like that. It's red. Then you can go reflection, brightness 30. Then texture, um, Fresnel. I put it to 20 on mixed um, strength, and then I'll go on glow. 
put the 10 on inner strength, 10 on outer strength, and radius 5. Then I add luminous, and I put the 10. And then I go down here, right click on this, and um, go to object soft shadow. And there you go, it makes it, it does a nice shadow. So um, let's see what we could do. <coughs> Alright. Now we put it on the text. Okay, render it out. And yeah, that's how it looks. Really, I like it. It looks nice. Oh, uh, shoot. Okay. Well, let's see. I'm going to put the text in there. Doesn't really look good. Uh, I'm going to do this. Ooh, there we go. Like it's just stuck in there or something. Okay. Uh, I'm not too used to this anymore. Okay, let's see. There we go. Now let's make it look like it's in there. Whoa. Alright, yeah. Alright, see? Looks nice. Kind of. Not really. <laughs> I didn't put it on right. But yeah, you know how to make. Now you know how to make all uh, materials. That's how I did it in my uh, video right here. Okay, let's see. Yeah, this. The thing. So yeah, now you can do it. And you can add the logos and stuff. So it's cool. So remember, you go on this. Projection. Cubic. Then 70 and 60. Because if you leave it like 100, it's like all going to be all like flattened. And, no, it's not going to be flattened, but it's going to be like like really stretched out and it's gonna like really look really bad quality. Nah, yeah. Gonna add a light. Alright, render it out. Yeah, it's not looking good in there because this isn't a really good material, so yeah. Uh well to um texture so alright guys I guess thanks for all well, actually yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching and like subscribe and help me get to hundred and ten subscribers I could put out my exclusive pack. I'm going to try to find some uh, materials that are actually exclusive, like I'm not going to get some from any packs. I'll get some from some packs, but not all from packs. I'm going to like go all over the place looking for some stuff that looks good, so yeah. Uh, it's going to be... Alright, whatever. Um, thanks for watching, guys, and I guess later.